We're in Lake George this morning. You may have heard an unusual sound, airboats on the ice. Don't see that too often. Here's News 10's Matt Mackey taking us behind the scenes of a unique state police training exercise. They go by many names. Airboat, swamp boat, even bayou boat. You're certain you've seen videos of them cruising through the Everglades down in Florida, but here they are now in front of you, propellers and all, being pushed onto a frozen solid Lake George. Turns out the New York State Police underwater recovery team has got a small fleet of them, and some of those who pilot airboats are actually more at home on the ice than in the wetlands. I personally have not operated on the Everglades. Sergeant Neil Case is one of them. If you're out on the ice this time of year and encounter trouble... An ATV or UTV snowmobile goes through the ice, uh, ice fisherman goes through... His team has got your back. Uh, we're getting many, many calls this time of year uh, to come out and perform either rescue or recovery. We caught up with the recovery team this morning at the Million Dollar Beach. Luckily, today, they're only here for training. New operators are learning firsthand how to pilot the airboats outside of their typical marshland environments. Uh, the ice is, is extremely slippery, um, so there are different techniques that we have to use in order to get the boat to, to even stop. Mm -hmm. We actually have to put it into a spin or else we'll just keep gliding until it finally comes to rest. So if you're along Lake George and you hear the drone of nine state police airboats in the middle of March, just know that we're here. It's it's not an emergency. We're we're just doing some training, and uh, you know we do try to get away from the village after we launch, uh, just to try to avoid some of that uh, noise pollution, if you will. In Lake George, I'm Matt Maggie, News 10, ABC. So cool to see them humming yeah. along the water there. <laughs> or we should say the ice.